Hello from Okinawa. I'm down here visiting a friend, which is why this update didn't come out on Wednesday. Wednesday, at the elementary school, I learned how to play Kick the Can. Um, I'm assuming most Americans don't know what this is. Most of the Americans I've encountered don't, although I've found one guy from California who does. Anyway, I've seen Kick the Can come up in, uh, in various anime and manga over the years, most notably, to me, in Oran High School Host Club. In it, there is one character who comes to the host club asking them to teach him how to make people like him. Um, he feels alone, lonely, doesn't realize he has plenty of people who like him, but that's a whole other thing. Anyway, one of his complaints in feeling lonely is that he has no one to play Kick the Can with. If you don't know what Kick the Can is, you might, be, might wonder, why do you want to go kicking cans with people, and why do you need other people to play Kick the Can? Well, here's why. Kick the Can is actually a variant on Hide and Seek. One person, whoever is it, stands next to a can, like just an empty fruit can or whatever, an empty can, and closes their eyes, it counts to however many, whatever the agreed upon number is, and everyone goes and hides. The person then tries to find these people if the demon, sorry, the Japanese call whoever's it the demon, um, if the person who's it finds someone, they call out the person's name, and if that person can reach the can fast enough to kick it before the, uh, the person who's it can step on the can and keep them from doing so, then they're safe and can go hide again, but otherwise they're out and they have to stand there by the can. Someone can release anyone who's been, who's been put out by sneaking around to the can without the Oni noticing them and kicking it, in which case everyone gets to go back and hide. So it's actually quite fun. It becomes, it ends up being everyone versus the person who's it, but generally the person who's it has some kind of advantage, or at least when we were playing it, that's what it was. So that's Kick the Can. That's why you need someone else to play Kick the Can, and I actually recommend playing Kick the Can. It's pretty cool. It, it injects some, some more fun into hide and seek, creates a need for strategy, like you don't just find some place to hide and, and hang out. I was actually hiding very close to the Oni in a clump of bushes. He could he could have seen me, except I was doing the hold very still thing, since movement really is easier to see than someone just being there. It was good times. Anyway, TTFN, that's all for now.